Are there any societies where there is no rite of passage, where men remain in that state of dependency on the mother, where they stay animals? Well, we have not many sociological matriarchies, but I read once a book about a South American Indian tribe where there was a actually sociological, not religious, but sociological matriarchy. And there, the women were happy, fat whores, uh, ordering the men about, and the men were lean, submissive, nervous creatures who were uh, planting the fields and doing the work for the women, kind of porters figures. And uh, positively, uh, wealth, uh, the, the, the world of the drives, sexuality, uh, earthly happiness was blossoming and negatively there was no spirit whatsoever a, a, a world of total stupidity so to speak of only living living very agreeably but but, but not thinking or having any ideas at, or spiritual realizations at all and the men accordingly unhappy and submissive and rather poor creatures. <laughs> but generally, these things balance back and forth. The, there will be another generation of men who will, in male protest again, put the things into a middle position or try to put the things in a middle position. It seems to be, the ideal is, seems to be not that either the men dominate or the women dominate, but that there is a kind of equal relationship, an e a balance of opposites.